uh, but came up short. What was uh, just the, the difference down the stretch where they got you tonight? Uh, you know, I think we're figuring out. There's a lot of positive things that come from this game. We're figuring out how to get that competitive edge back. I think for a stretch back in like December, we had that defensive edge, we had that, that competitiveness, we had that fire. And we were close to getting that for 40 minutes a game. And as of late, we haven't had that. And so we've had a big emphasis on that, especially after the game on Thursday, of just coming out and competing. You know, we, we have our schemes, we have our things we want to take away. But at the end of the day, we, we have a lot of talent. If we can compete for 40 minutes, we'll be fine. And I think uh, it's, it's rough, it sucks losing a game. But there's a lot we can learn from that, and I think there's a lot we improved on. Like Coach said in the locker room today, we're completely different than we were 48 hours ago. So I'm just proud of the way our guys battled back and been excited for what this team can do. When you guys pulled even there late, how confident were you that you guys could pull off another win? Very, very. When we were down eight or 10 or whatever we were down, we were very confident that we'd come out with the win. And that's just how this team is. I feel like that's how we played the game tonight. We didn't play 10 minutes. Uh, we had them on their heels for a while there. Uh, they're a very good team. They made tough shots at key moments. And uh, it's, just a, it's just a tough one. You know, it just happens. What did you think of Luke's performance tonight? Luke's great. I mean, he, he does it every day in practice. Uh, we, we've said since the beginning of the year, no one can guard Luke on the block. He's the most frustrated guy to guard. He's, he's very fundamentally sound. He's going to make the right reads. He's going to finish inside. And he showed that tonight. So very proud of the way he played. After they hit the three-pointer, do you feel like you guys maybe rushed it or got just a little too panicky or you know hurried up a little bit too much there? Um, I don't know. I think guys were just trying to make plays. And mm -hmm. I think the shots that Eli were taking and the shots TJ were taking, those are great shots. And they're such good players that every time a shot goes up, I think it's going to fall. And the rest of our team thinks it's going to fall. So if one of those guys takes a shot with five seconds left in the shot clock or 25 seconds left in the shot clock, we all think it's going down. And they're such talented offensive players that uh, we're going to trust them to make plays. You think uh, Gonzaga, I mean, they, they seem like obviously a lot of different guys. There's a lot of guys left. But how do you feel like they're going to be this year? Yeah, they have seen, like I said, a lot of different guys, but they still have a lot of depth. Yeah, they're, they're a very deep team. Uh, they have their rotations down pretty well where they sub and keep their legs fresh. And uh, they're, a, they're a top 25 team for a reason. They're, they're very talented, one through five. They bring great guys off the bench. So it's a very good team. Hats off to them. They, they played a great game. All right. Thanks, you.